एवरीवन वेलकम टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल नरूला स्टेनोग्राफी माय नेम इज़ साहिल नरूला एंड आई एम प्रेजेंटली वर्किंग इन हरियाणा एग्रीकल्चर डिपार्टमेंट आई हैव क्वालिफाइड एसएससी स्टेनोग्राफर एंड दिल्ली हाई कोर्ट स्किल टेस्ट एज वेल ऑन द बेसिस ऑफ माई एक्सपीरियंस आई विल प्रोवाइड यू डिक्टेशन दैट विल बी हेल्पफुल इन योर स्किल टेस्ट सो बी रेडी टेन सेकेंड्स Five seconds. Start, Mr. President. When I received your invitation to inaugurate this, the thirty-ninth annual session of the Federation of Indian Chambers of Commerce and Industry, I was somewhat hesitant in accepting it. I was aware. that since independence each annual session of the federation has been inaugurated by the prime minister this in fact was the main reason for my reluctance these annual meetings are beginning to become almost a ritual and i am not much of a believer in rituals i am also not happy about the tendency to turn to the prime minister to inaugurate every function of importance and to consider that a function which is not inaugurated by the prime minister is only of second rate importance i feel strongly that other cabinet ministers as also people in public life outside official dome should perform some functions far from frequently than they are at present doing your experience will always be useful within the ranks of industry the younger group feels that it is not fully playing its part i have often spoken of my intention to keep in touch with the younger generation I am calling together some younger industrialists, technicians and managers from both the private and public sectors to discuss concrete and specific problems with the board framework of our basic objectives. It will be a sharing of thought and perhaps evolving of new ideas. Dynamic changes are needed now. in attitudes and functions in your address mr president you have pointed out that india is still a depressingly poor country and expressed concern that we have not succeeded well enough in our effort to fight poverty and develop our economy poverty is indeed the central problem facing us and it is the way in which we set out to tackle it that we as a nation will be judged it is a long and arduous battle that we have to wage it calls for clarity of purpose for determination for unity it demands of us all the perseverance the discipline the hard work of which we are capable slowly and steadily we shall be building a new and progressive nation in which even the poorest in our country will be able to enjoy a minimum level of living there will be fuller employment more widespread facilities of education and health greater opportunities for youth and less inequalities of income and wealth so friends please like share and subscribe my channel and thank you